people that knew him said he was quiet. But Derek Bird, a 52-year-old taxi driver, went on the rampage with a shotgun and then killed himself. Police say at least five are dead. Many more are injured around Whitehaven in Cumbria. Speaking in the Commons, David Cameron expressed his shock. When lives and communities are suddenly shattered in this way, our thoughts should be with all those caught up in these tragic events. Residents across West Cumbria were told to stay indoors by the police as the terror unfolded. Um, we're told by a local uh, who shouted over to us saying that someone had been shot. And, uh, but so we didn't know what was going on. We were told by the caretaker to move indoors because he's been told by the police uh, that everyone's got to get indoors around the area. Eyewitnesses described the disaster. And saw a policeman redirecting traffic whilst having his arm bandaged, which seemed very peculiar. I turned, saw another police car across the middle of Duke Street with a body lying on the side of the road, uh, a police incident jacket over his face. At first I just thought, has, he, uh, has somebody collapsed? But somebody near me said, no, he's being shot. Gun laws in the UK are amongst the toughest in the world. But still, 600,000 people legally own a shotgun. But it only takes one gun in the wrong hands to cause a tragedy.